<sighs> hey, you guys. How y'all doing? I decided to make a video today um, based on I am sick of this goat conversation. So good morning and good afternoon to y'all out there in the sports world. I thought I'd bring a seasoned approach to the game, okay? And um, a lot of people are really, really focused on LeBron James. LeBron James. LeBron James. <laughs> and um, Michael Jordan. By the way, the All-Star game and that uh, halftime show of 75 Best had to be one of the best, uh, best um, productions um, anywhere in terms of sports. That was a very, very touching, memorable moment, okay? One that you'll never see again. All those great players in one room. Now, here's my problem. I don't think people are very objective when it comes to basketball sometimes and when it comes to LeBron James and Michael Jordan and the greats, right? But those three in particular, because I think that things have to be put in context, right? Now, Michael Jordan, of course, would have, in my opinion, this is probably one of the best shooting guards that ever played the game, okay? He could play the point now if you needed him to, but he was a better two guard, okay? LeBron James, LeBron James is really a football player on the basketball court, okay? You'll probably never see, uh, see nobody like him again because they'll probably, nobody's going to probably take care of their body like that. Look at the boy out of Memphis. I mean, not Memphis, um, Pelicans. You know, uh, he was the closest thing to a big, big body. But I don't think his body is going to break down because that's too much weight to be pounding up on them knees and hips and everything else. Trust me. Now, what I do take offense to, y'all, is when y'all start talking about the jab. Lou Alcindor, formerly known. I said, how can they? Yeah, LeBron then broke his, what, season and playoff scoring record, right? I think one thing that we need to take into consideration, this is my opinion, okay? I cannot put, I think that your jab is better than, you have to put him in that, in his position, simply because he's won on every level. From high school to college to every level that it was, he won on. Multiple times in college. Second of all, he did go to college and play four years. What if he'd have left and came right out of Power Memorial and went to the pros like LeBron James? Okay, now we're talking a whole different stat. So in my opinion, in my humble opinion, y'all, the jab is better. I have to put him as if you want to talk statistically, he, and, and not only that, nobody can't stop that sky hook. Nobody. LeBron has yet to do something that nobody can't stop. I mean, I didn't see them blocked, right? Uh, LeBron is not the same. And even when he played as a younger man, he was, you know, he was blocked. Okay. He was just good. And he's still great. Not taking anything away from LeBron James. Let's get that um, straight, because I respect him on and off the court. So, but I thought I thought about it. If you just want to talk statistic, y'all, come on now, let's be real. How in the hell can you put LeBron James with the jab? I call him the jab because he jabbed that hook. Nobody could ever, 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 ever stop it. And ain't nobody ever done it again with such precision and grace and finesse. Who can go to the three-point line in the corner and skyhook a three? All right? 
it, you ain't going to see it done no more. So when you start talking about the GOAT, if y'all ain't never watched the jab play, it's really hard. And if you look at the totality of their other situation, look at the fact that LeBron came straight from high school and went to the pros for a 20-year career, and bam. Straight from high school to college. Now, let's think about this. Jab paid, played four years in college, then came out and scored all them points. Now, if that's not impressive, I don't know what is. But I'm waiting on y'all comments because I know you're going to leave them below. Some of y'all going to disagree with me. So come on with it. Come on. Make your point. Come on, Cletus. Come on. I'll see y'all in the next video.